good morning 10 standard students today we are going to study about different types of printers so it is uh, again the next level of the devices used in the computers to do the tedious work out of it and let us study about the printers that a printer is a device that accepts text and graphics outcome from a computer printer transfers the information to paper usually to understand size sheets of paper means whatever the data inside a computer and uh, if it is stored inside a computer and we want to take anything out of it in a hard copy format so we can get the printouts we can get the printouts of all the data stored inside the computers and uh, the device which are used to take the printouts are called the printers and it's uh, we can get the printout in various forms in various size various standards and various types of sheets then printers vary in size the printer which are used in a computer they have they are different in size speed sophistication and cost in general more expensive printers are used for high resolution and color printing so the more uh, the costly the printer will be the better quality of the output will be uh, as a output out of those printers so and then we have this uh, hierarchical table of a printer then the types of a printer here we can understand that uh, basically a printers are of two types impact printer and non impact printers so impact printers as the name suggests that uh, it is called an impact printer because uh, it produces um, a little bit of noise when this printing works is going on and then for the example of impact printer are uh, dot matrix printer drum printer and chain printer whereas in non impact printer it produces less sound as compared to the impact printers and the further categorization of non impact printers are in jet printer and laser printer so we can understand this types of printer uh, with the notes that I have prepared separately and uh, here we have let us study and uh, I have taken this information from this whtips.com and uh, let us study about the printer and its different types there are well known output devices which are used and utilized for printing output on papers and are called as a hard copy so the printout that we get from a printer out of a computer are called a hard copy the output produced from them is almost permanent now it is permanent form and user can produce and create out output such as text or pictures pictures and images the output produced on display devices such as monitor is called a soft copy and whatever the display or whatever the result we see in the monitors uh, are called soft copy and when we get it in the form of uh, printout they are called the hard copy so, so this is the hierarchical differentiation table of a printer where we can see the two basic type of printers impact printer and non-impact printers here we can see the dot matrix printers and line printers as an impact printer and the further two types we have just studied about uh, impact printers are uh, drum printer and chain printer we can also add here the drum printers we are going to study about those printers also here drum printers and the chain printers these all are the impact printers non-impact printers we have laser inkjet thermal printers photo printers and plotters like pen based plotter or electrostatic plotters which have which we already have studied in our previous lessons so let us study further about the impact printer the prime example of impact printers are dot matrix printer 
Digital printer, drum printers, character printer, or line printers. They are fairly similar, like the old typewriters used earlier. The printers use acquired such as graphic or contents on a piece of paper by striking a component against the ink ribbon and physically and straightforwardly contact the paper. That is why they are called impact printer because the the printhead which is used to take the print out uh, connect with the paper physically. So they create noise while striking components like head and ribbon strike against the paper. They are extensively used in small organization factories and used where large number of printouts need to be obtained. They are cheap, slow and loud. They create low quality output hence they are widely used in those sectors where quality does not matter where user needs the quantity. Okay, so these are the impact printers and the um, uh, example of impact printers are dot matrix printer. So they create images when wire pins of the print head instrument strike the ink ribbon or strip later the ink is exchanged on the paper when there is an impact in the form of series of dots of matrix form so this is the diagram of a uh, dot matrix printer uh, and we use a continuation sheet in such printers uh, uh, continuation sheet means uh, the sheet uh, which uh, can be used in a continuous form so we have a dots alongside the corners of this paper and then we can take the continuous print out uh, we do not have to feed the paper continuously in, in, uh, we have got a roll of paper and we can use these sheets in a continuation print out and we must uh, you must have seen this type of printers in the banks so the speed of these printers are 30 to 1100 characters per second which is uh, very commonly known as the cps so whenever we encounter this word cps it means characters per second depending on the printer capability and quality of the printouts they are low quality and low cost preferably used in banks and used in the application where high volume printouts have to be produced so where the where we need a high uh, volume printouts we need uh, to have this kind of printer next type of printer is line printers they are very high speed printers where the whole line is printed at once so the whole line uh, of a on a paper gets printed in a one go so that is why their speed is a little higher than the uh, DMPs or dot mass printer, their speed is characterized as the speed in which it prints the whole line in a minute. So, here we encounter the uh, abbreviation line per minute. LPM stands for line per minute. As continuous printing technology has been developed, some of them print, can print up to 3500 LPM, means in a minute it can print 3500 lines. So, it is a good speed to print. Next is the drum printer. A drum printer consists of a solid cylindrical drum that has raised characters in bands of its surface. So in a drum printer, this is a, a diagram of a drum printer where we can see uh, the drum and it has uh, different letters embossed on it and uh, when the hammer strikes on the paper and the required letter has been get printed over the paper and this is a real image of a drum printer and if we zoom this image you can see a different uh, characters which are embossed on the drum so here we can see that uh, this number typically ranges from 80 to 132 print position so these many characters in a row we can find on the drum printer the drum rotates at a rapid speed and for each possible print position there is a print hammer located behind the paper this hammer strikes the paper along the ink ribbon here you can see that the paper and this is a inked ribbon hand and it will strike on the paper and wherever that uh, particular uh, text has to be printed and then uh, this drum will rotate at a good speed it's a rapid speed and then accordingly uh, whichever word has to be printed this head will move from right to left and then it will 
strike on the required letter or a letter to be printed on the paper so this is how it works and uh, this goes very fast and the speed of this drum printer uh, are of the range from 300 to 200 lines per minute so 300 to 2000 lines per minute it can it has a capability of printing uh, these many lines so it is also a very high speed printer next type of uh, impact printer is a chain printer and uh, here you can see it uses chain technology and the chain printer uses a change of uh, chain of print characters wrapped around the two pulleys these are the two pulleys and in between these letters on the chain are moving around accordingly and uh, wherever this uh, letter has to be print it get con get connected and it it comes to the contact with the paper and such uh, letters um, to make a form to form a word get printed on the paper so this is how it works and here also the hammer then strikes the page pressing the paper against the ribbon and then the character located at the desired print position and an impression of the character is left on the page and then when this um, print head strikes on the paper that particular letter gets printed on the page the chain keeps rotating until all the required print position on the line f field the page moves up to the print the next line speed of the chain printer ranges from 400 to 2500 characters per minute now the speed of the printer here is in characters per minute in a minute it can print up to 205 2500 2500 characters per minute ranges from 400 to 2500 characters per minute this is the real image of a keychain printer next comes the non-impact printer and they are called non-impact printer because they produce is low noise and then the it the head does not touch the paper to get uh, to take the printouts so some of them use showering and other use warm heat and pressure for producing line and graphics and they do not make any, make any noise as they do not physically touch the paper so that is why they are called non-impact printer and the speed measured is in ppm ppm stands for pages per minute here and the types of non-impact printers are laser printer, inkjet printer, thermal printer, photo printer, and plotters. So, in laser printer, they are having potential of converting computing output into print page by page. They are high speed, high quality, and superb non-impact printers, and are enabled up to print out in A4 sizes and legal page sizes. So, uh, there is a removal plate where the paper is physically embedded for print out. They can print black white or a color printer and the print black and color printer in high resolution this high, the result output of a laser printer is very high and the quality is also very good so this is the image of a laser printer and the speed of the laser printer is also very good so they save the entire document before printing if it fails to save or the capacity of the document is larger than the printer memory it usually throws an error message so uh, before taking a print uh, it has some buffer memory which can store the document in standard buffer memory but uh, we have to see that the size of the file itself should not be more than the buffer otherwise it will not be able to save the next type of uh, non impact printer is inkjet printer and it is very popular and very common printer and it's, it is also known as a household printer and this is a non uh, type of non impact printer and they utilize spout of splash ink on the paper and they are new number of small nozzles and which splashes ink on the paper in the proper format to create image and used in the home for small offices and where black and white color printouts are to be produced so this is a diagram of a inkjet printer Nowadays, printer can be produced on a variety of objects such as envelope, t-shirt, visiting cards. So, uh, all sort of printing can be done using this inkjet printers. And cartridges are used here. And then we have a photo printer. This is very advanced printer and which is used to take the uh, real photo printouts. So, these are the different types of printers uh, categorized by they are uh, working like impact and non-impact printer. So we have studied about two, two different types. So then in our next video, we'll study further about the advantages and the disadvantages and the differentiation between the printers like impact printers and non-impact printers. So till then, goodbye, stay safe. Thank you very much.